team as well as uh, the secretariat but most importantly the support we continue to receive from government because we can never thank you enough. <laughs> so honorable minister as you've been saying we are now playing in the big league or champions league so it's my honor now to allow you to address the team okay. very much i'll also be very brief because i'm very excited I'm very, very excited. First, I want to recognize the presence of uh, my fellow cabinet ministers, members <coughs> of parliament, uh, PS, director of sport, the full position of Zambia president, his general secretary, and indeed, everyone who is invited, the coach, the technical bench, we need to recognize you, and the players. First, I want also to sound as a broken record that uh, we need to pour, I think, some congratulatory messages to everyone. First, congratulations to everyone. Uh, it, it seems to be easy, but it wasn't easy. This journey has not been very easy. You know you carried more than 19 million on your shoulders, especially with players and taking the bench. You aid me every time telling the person of Zambia that we don't have a reason not to qualify. <laughs> because we've not been there for three consecutive times. So we, we, we are saying we cannot afford not to be there for the fourth consecutive time. And you've just delivered what we, you promised. I was, I was having a chat with uh, uh, Frankie, uh, the captain, Rwambo, who also assured me. I think it was also fashion. They assured me that no, this time around we are going to Africa for the finals. And true to their word, this is what we've witnessed. And you know, it is very, very important that we have won Ivory Coast because it, for me, that was a revenge. Yeah. It was a revenge. Before you could assemble a good team, they walloped us 3-1 at their backyard. But today we have now revenged. And I think now we've, we've sent some shivers in their camp that Zambia is not a, a, a team that you can just play around with. Most importantly, we have qualified before even playing the last game. I think that is the most important thing. So, as we go to tomorrow, it's now Zambia that will be looking for maximum points in tomorrow's, so that we qualify with more than flying colors. So, I want to thank you most sincerely, and I think what is important for me now to tell you is that as we are excited as government, because when government is excited, it means the whole nation is excited. Now that all of us are excited, yes, remember fashion and others when we met in the office, we had increased some, some allowances. And this time around, the only thing I will do is to make sure that every qualification comes with a bonus. I want to make sure that players are motivated. You need to be motivated. And for that, I want to announce, President, that there's a $5,000 for each, for, for every player. Just that is a bonus, not those are winning bonuses, no. For qualification, for you just to take us to Ivory Coast. So, meaning, 
you have the five thousand dollars as your winning bonus, and also five thousand dollars for qualifying. <laughs> So that we motivate you, what we are doing, what we are doing is that the, as we motivate you, we are also motivating the Zambians, the Zambians themselves, because they want to see you winning, and there are people that may not understand what comes along with winning. So for us who understand what comes along with winning, we are able to know that if we just inject something, I know we have a limited budget, but always this ministry has been has been there to make sure that we find resources with my permanent secretary. That is the, and, and you know when you're working well with your permanent secretary, money is not a problem. Because we can even dig somewhere. <laughs> and find so PS, please make sure that the, each player, the technical bench, everyone who is involved gets their, their pay. Including us. <laughs> <laughs> And I also want to appreciate the technical bench. When Grant came into my office, the first time he was engaged, the assignment I gave Grant was that we, we are looking at nothing but to qualify the team to Africa Cup finals. And he has just delivered. So let's first... Uh, <laughs> you know, sport, sport everywhere is very, very important. We always say it unifies people, it's a unifying factor. You've seen how, how electric it was inside the stadium. So no one can talk about anything because of these players. So I want also to thank you. I thank you for, your, for, for the job all done. Please continue making us proud. Pay, continue putting the smiles on the face of the Zambian people because I think that's what we deserve yes. as Zambian people. So thank you once again. Thank you, Coach. Please, very yeah. well,